everybody out YouTube. This is Michael the Geek for Life with another unboxing for July of 2016. And this one is, whoop, upside down, the BAM box. It's second appearance on this channel, actually. Uh, of course, a fairly new box and a fairly unique box. They do a lot with autographs and things like that, um, so it's pretty cool. Uh, the last box I got, well, actually, that was the first box that I got. I wasn't super thrilled with, but I could definitely... Um, see where it had a lot of value and where a lot of people would like it. Um, I have seen unboxings before that one that were actually really cool and had stuff in it that I wanted. So I just assumed that the first box I got really was just not meant for me. And so that's okay because I've gotten boxes from other companies that just weren't geared uh, toward interests that I had. But this one is supposed to have Star Trek in it. It's a galactic theme. It's supposed to have Star Trek, Guardians of the Galaxy, Star Wars, Aliens, and I don't know if there's anything else in it, but that is a theme that is right up my alley. Um, so let's go ahead and cut into this. Now I will say that this box is a little different for me, just on the um, trying to give it a value. I'm not great with autographs. I've been trying to get a little bit better with that. So hopefully this will be a little bit closer to the value. Some people pointed out on my last one that I way undervalued a lot of things which is perfectly fair because, I, like I said, I really am not that great at autographs, but I'm going to give it a try. Let's see. Straight out of BAM box. Want to trade an item? We'll join the party. So I guess there's actually like a little community you can go to to trade items. I've heard about that on their website, and they sent an email about it. So just a little card on that. Win this Stanley sign Ronan the Accuser 16 by 20 autograph. So there's that little contest. I think they had a contest in the last one too. Just post a picture with your favorite item using hashtag the BAM box. I'll probably do that because I would like to get that. And the pen. True love. And this is Groot. So that's a nice little Groot pen there. And these pens are actually worth something, so this is one of the few boxes I'm actually going to value the pen at probably about $5. So you don't do that very much, but this one is worth it. And I got a 1-Up. Congratulations, you got a 1-Up card. You have an upgraded or limited edition item in your box, and it's a yellow card. I don't know what yellow means, but I'm very happy that I got one up. And let's open this thing up. Paper. Here. I'll let the cat play with that. First item up Mars Space Sand. Pour the sand into a cup of water, form shapes and figures with the sand while underwater. Remove the sand with a spoon and it will be dry. I think I've seen stuff like this, like in gift shops. Kind of a weak first item for me personally. Um, I'll give it about. Hmm. I think this normally goes for like five bucks or something, maybe six. So there's that. I like that sand you can get that like always feels wet and you can just shape it and then it just falls apart when you pick it up. I don't know what it's called, it's like kinetic sand or something. I don't really know what it's called. Second, ooh, it's a Star Trek item. And it looks, well, I'll show it to you first and then I'll open it up. So it looks like a next generation style com badge. Very cool. Oh, there's rank pens in here too. And it's made of metal, I think. It's hard to tell. I think it's got metal in it, like metal and plastic. So that's pretty cool. Oop, sorry. And it's got the rank pens. You can put the pips on your collar. That is really cool. Ooh, there we go. So you can give yourself whatever rank you want to, although I don't know why anybody would go for less than captain. That is awesome. Um, I'll give that about $12 value for that. That's really cool. I like that. So there it is again. Really like that item. That's a good one. That's a good Star Trek item. And we have our aliens item, uh, alien resurrection, yeah. uh, authentic wardrobe, exclusive costume worn by the Origa crew. 
So I've seen these types of things before, like you can get a card and it has a piece of the uh, costume in it. Uh, this card offered exclusively by the BAM box features an authentic piece of wardrobe worn by the Origa crew in the movie Star Trek, or sorry, the movie Alien Resurrection. Uh, this jacket was acquired by the production team for use by the cast during filming. It was distressed for filming and features Origa United Systems military patches attached to the left arm, limited edition. So that's pretty cool. And I don't quite know how you would get it out. It looks like there's a way. But I'm not going to take it out, of course. Um, these usually go for about 10 to $15 online. I'll give it a 10 just for the value on this, but... There we go. That's a nice little item. Put that there. And this one's upside down, but it does say the Bandbox Certificate of Authenticity. And it's a Green Lantern item. Numbered, it's a print. Numbered 555 out of 1999. So there that is. Not from the movie, from a comic. It's personally, or is it, has obtained this item personally or through a trusted partner in the industry and is guaranteed to be authentic. And it does have a signature at the bottom. I'm not sure who it is, but it does have a signature there. It's a nice print. Um, I'll give it a $10 value for now. And let's see, it's actually printed on just regular cardstock, but it has a really nice backing to it so it doesn't bend. And of course, Green Lantern and Sinestro. Put that there. And this is our Star Wars item. And it looks like Darth Vader with his lightsaber. And I think it's one of those shadow things. Um, like you set it up somewhere, and then when you turn the light on, it casts a shadow on the back wall. Is what I'm pretty sure it is. Made out of metal. Pretty cool. Uh, probably goes for about 10 bucks. It's a nice little item though, I can't wait to try that out. Put it up. Not really getting a shadow right now. But if I get it close to the wall, I can get a shadow, but I'm sure if I put a brighter light on it, it would probably do it really well. And let's see. I wonder which one of these was my one up. Uh, custom home sorry, custom handmade steel Star Wars silhouette statues. Okay, that's what that's called. Uh, from the craftsmanship of Smitty Tut Designs comes these custom handmade steel Star Wars silhouette figures made exclusively in this size for Bambox, standing at 5 inches tall and made from forged steel. Most will either get Yoda or Boba Fett, but 500 will get a yellow 1-up card and receive the 8-inch black Darth Vader. So that was my 1-up item and it is taller than the others. Uh, Bambox exclusive True Love Rocket Raccoon and Group Pen. Uh, let's see. Designer Nick something is back with this month's BAM pen. And for the first time, we have two pens you can collect. Our favorite love story from Guardians of the Galaxy, Rocket Raccoon, and Group True Love. You will receive one of the pens and will have to trade to get the set. You can trade at the bambox.com slash community. And watch out for the green one up card, which shows the black and gold variants numbered on the back of the pen out of 250. So, there were basically four types of pens you could get. I got the generic group pen, you could also get the generic rocket, and of course the gold and black of each. Mars Space Sand, this amazing sand will not get wet. Dump it in a glass of water, remove it with a spoon, and it will emerge completely dry. The sand has the same properties as Martian soil and is used by scientists at NASA. Mars Exploration Experiments, Custom Star Trek The Next Generation Badge and Rank Pen Set. Step aboard the Starship Enterprise and choose your ranking with this Custom Badge and Ranking Pips Pen Set. Dies struck from a sheet of copper and individually hand polished. These badges are cosplay quality and it did look like it was really good quality. And if you've got a Gold Star Instant Winner uh, card this month, you will receive a signed comic from titles including Superman, Green Lantern, Infinity War, and others. Check the back of your comic board to see exactly who signed it. So I didn't get that. So that's everything I just read. You can see the silhouettes there, the comics over here, and the pens down there. And on the back, Bandbox exclusive. 
Thanos by artist Logan Pack. The Battle by artist something Blake Henriksen. For the first time, we have two artists in this month's box, and these are Bambox exclusive prints. You will receive either Thanos or The Battle by Blake Henriksen. I didn't get either. Oh, The Battle. Okay, The Battle is The Green Lantern. Uh, the Battle, Green Lamb, the Watch out for the red one-up card to get the Thanos black and white variant, or the Battle Red Lantern variant. I didn't get either of those. To collect them all, trade at the BamboxCommunity.com. Logan Pack is at Roswell, New Mexico. Whatever I say. And down here, the Alien Resurrection. Let's see. Bambox exclusive authentic wardrobe card from the movie Alien Resurrection, taken from a screen used jacket worn by the Aruba crew in the movie Alien Resurrection. Is this Bambox exclusive authentic wardrobe card? Each card contains an authentic piece of the jacket worn in the movie. This is a Bambox exclusive limited edition piece. So, the. I mean, I'm happy I got the one up. That's my first one up from the box. was very happy to see that. And it's a cool one, but I probably would have been happier with definitely the Gold Star, but everybody would have loved that. Or one of the alternate prints. So, what I got is a $52 value. This is a $32 box. Um, so, you definitely get your value. In fact, it might be a little higher than that. I don't know. The print could be a little bit more. Tell me in the comments below if you think it is. Uh, definitely a good box. I'm going to give this one a 4 out of 5. They did a really good job with it. Really like the Star Trek item. The Star Wars item's good. The print is good. Uh, I like the alien item, even though it's from Resurrection, but whatever. Um, so it's a pretty good box. 4 out of 5 is above average. Uh, $52 value. And resale factor is pretty decent. I don't think you could get much for the sand, but I think everything else you could sell, and you'd probably get your money back for the box if you didn't like the box. So I guess that, oh, and the pen. I forgot about the pen. So I guess that'll do it for this month, Bam Box. Next month is themed crazy, and they've only shown pictures of the Joker, so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, definitely hoping to be uh, one-upped again, or maybe even get a gold star, because that would be super awesome. Um, so I guess that'll do it for this video. Thanks for watching. Like I said, $52 value. Resale factor is pretty good, and it's a 4 out of 5 rating. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Congratulations, you've made it to the end of my video. Thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw, feel free to subscribe. I'm always doing more videos. Press the like button if you like this one. Leave a comment and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. And also, there is a way to support your favorite YouTubers, including me, I hope, financially, without dipping into your own pocket. And it's actually very simple. Um, YouTubers get paid by interactions with the ads. It doesn't matter how many views the video gets, it matters how many times people interact with the ads. So. If you'd like to um, contribute financially to your favorite YouTubers or your favorite YouTube videos, you can watch that um, little commercial ad at the beginning of the video, or you can click on one of the little banner ads that show up at the bottom. I know most people just click them away or skip the ad, but honestly, if you interact with them, you, um, the, I'm sorry, the advertisers will actually give that YouTuber a little bit of money. So that's a great way to help out without dipping into your own pocket, and you can't lose with that. Thank you very much for watching again. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.